Oh, oh yeah, this is one of those like uh, gotcha life movie things. Uh, I don't know what I'm doing here, so I think it's best if I just read a few comments to get a better idea of what I should do. LGBT, furries, bronies, fanboys, and weebs. Uh, every community is toxic trash, and I've learned this by staying and observing it for a while, in my opinion. I mean, they're, they ain't wrong, so I, I don't know. Let me read a couple more. When I was six, me and my friend were playing house, and we pretended to do the no-no. We're both girls. Am I gay? It's <laughs> the no-no. This is, is this second grade or some shit? Knowing this community, though, it probably is. Don't be mean. Gosh, life will always be amazing. You are the person that's getting worse and meaner. What the hell does this even mean? What the fuck is this? Hello, can you can you shut the fuck up? Thanks. All right, this will be the last one. I promise. This is requested heavily because people want me to do this again. So, uh, but I need to respond to a main concern. No, gotcha life is not all bad. No community is all terrible and toxic. There's toxic parts of every community. That's just what we're focusing on because that's what's funny. If you want to see the good stuff, the good part of Gotcha Life, I recommend this video by Nani right here. Shout out Nani, it's very good and informal on that behalf of Gotcha Life. With that being said, we're going to look at the great stuff of Gotcha Life now because that's what you all want to see. That's not what you want to see. Hi, Joker here. Gotcha Life extraordinaire, in my way. So, you're here for the good stuff. You know, the cack. And not the like, who cares about real, real good videos? No, nobody does. <sighs> who cares? Not me. Welcome to the third worst of gotcha life video. Shut up! I truly do feel bad for these videos making everyone hate an entire community. Although I don't appreciate gosh YouTubers literally telling me to die from a crack overdose. If I could go back and find that one, I would, baby. Anyway, uh, gotcha. Oh, come the fuck up! Oh shit, what do we have here? We got, like, a family going on here. And there's Linkin Park in the background. I'm just sitting here being like, Oh, man, what a nice, happy, edgy family we got here, guys. Also, why is the mom naked? After school, we just don't go to detention because we're cool kids. You know, I just realized that half of the time since the screen's moving, you can't even see the text from the text bubbles that the characters are saying, and now I'm just like dying inside because now I don't understand at all what's going on. Also, who the fuck is Jason? I know I should talk a little more about my feelings, but I'm so unsure. Cause there's two options I could keep it at all. Or I could let everything out, and then you maybe realize. But I could scream into my pillow and then bottle it up. And I could fill it to the top, and then I'll seal it shut. And there's a chance that it could crack, and then I'll let it all out. But I will always have a bottle or a sore on my tongue, or I could pour it in a cup of lemon. Oh, 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 shit. Jason tucks Santiago. You know what that means. Holy shit, he's not supposed to touch him like that. That's, that's, you have to get consent first. That is disgusting. Holy shit, you need to ask for consent before you touch somebody. That is unbelievable. Wow. That you try my concoction. To me, that doesn't really seem like that's the greatest option. So tell me what Oh, wow, they're having sex on the bed. Whoa, whoa, gay yowie. Ooh, like the title says. Oh, Wow, is that a threesome going on here? The poor father in this is just very funny. <laughs> he's like waking up his kid to go to school, right? And he's just opening the door and be like, Wake up, son, it's time to go to school. And then he sees three naked men on his bed. Wonderful, wonderful storytelling. Dude. In the first gotcha video, we saw the first part to this, so here's the sequel. For reference, brown hair dude was abusive, and the other guy left and moved on. How fucking-
fucking bipolar are these characters, bruh? You just beat his ass. This dude just said fuck it and teleport. <laughs> <laughs> Who is this bougie ass girl? Huh? Who's Titus? T Titus. Huh? Oh shit. They got the animal collective up in this bitch. This is glass animals. This is what they been doing. No one's staring at your bougie ass nipples. I don't see anything. That's his dad? Why your dad looks so young? Your dad looks like these kids I see at the pre-K. What? Oh, this is like how Padme died. No! Motherfucker turned no clip on! Oh! Oh no! Are we? F you're dumb. That dude was stupid. There's a city right there. No. Should have got his KD up. Okay. No, no, no. I need to get this straight. This video is promoting the fact that being with a specific person is gonna make you happy and get rid of your mental issues. That's a very bad message and not true. Fuck that. So before this even starts, I just want to point out the, uh, the title and the time of the video. Alright, so this, this person right here just took Daisy and just, they're by the stairs, I assume. Like, this, this looks like a, like, the inside of like a... Like a USPS. Wow, okay, just gotta distance yourself from them? What if What if you wanna hug them? Like, just give them a hug. After all, it's a lesbian slash gay school. <laughs> What's with the shock? Why are you shocked at this? Did you not know before you started attending the school? Like, how how could you not know this? That's what I need to know. <laughs> wait a minute, wait a minute, let me, let me go back there. Hopefully no one likes it. <laughs> ah, this, this video is beautiful, I love it. I am 15 years old, and I love the color. Who loves yellow? Whose favorite color is yellow? If your favorite color is yellow, I'm deleting your YouTube channel. <laughs> they, they don't even use a gotcha life thing for the ring. They just draw it on. <laughs> Perfect. So from what, uh, from what I'm understanding, uh, Daisy forgot her uh, swimsuit, and now Aubrey is the person who's giving her one. And earlier, if we recall correctly, Aubrey is the person that had the big ass crush on Daisy based completely off her looks, not the personality. I promise I'm not a simp. Back again with the <laughs> drawn on ring text. <laughs> They're both take up. Oh, oh. All right, so that was it. My final verdict of this. I'm never doing this ever again. Yeah. Yeah. This sound like about a billion. Damn, this dude transformed us to be curved in the worst way imaginable. Sheesh. Hey, yeah. Fuck no, that dude's gonna wreck havoc. Ex girl be talking shit, but I don't really like to do the arguing. And I don't really like to do the arguments unless we talking about what kind of car we in. Park conversations with Parkinson's. Constantly trying to readjust the seat. Constantly trying to readjust the beat. Think about just readjusting me. Uh. Back again. Tell these boys I'm back again. Tell these hoes I'm back. <laughs> wow. 
boy. Yeah, my phone ring more than the average, man. Hey, what I'm averaging? Better if I had a calculator. What? I, uh... Better if I calculate the data. Catch up on the Sunday newspaper. Yeah. Reminisce. What I have decoded from the gotcha language is that these people pull out weapons from their ass. And almost every gay relationship is fetishized from head to toe. What? You know that there's more pet names than babe, right? The, the gosh YouTubers know that. Reminisce my remnants. Ah. Reminisce about this. Yeah, in that too. Little nappy headed boy with a tattoo. Cats out the hat in the bag too. It's all in the sauce like it's rag gold. Talking cash money over cash rules. Because y'all are fucking freaks, I would hide too. Yeah. Talking cash money over cash rules. Hey. Hey. Yeah, we stand abuse. Let's go. The parents of these creators are just raising a cult of narcissists. I seem to forget people were born after 2004. Putting the shtick in the box never had a better definition. Beatings down the highway, all in the Chevy doing. Manipulation check. Manipulation check. Manipulation check. Manipulation check. <coughs> manipulation check. Oh, they got new fits, huh? Oh my God. My fucking life is ruined. Some fat. <laughs> I'm sorry. Um, what? Some faggot on Instagram stole my Roblox account. I'm not even laughing at the text, I'm laughing at the cat. If you see this, you're now in ultra mega heat for, f for 48 hours. I'm not reading that. I'm the cop and you need to go to jail. Censor. <laughs> Billy Eilish, Billy haters. If you see this, your boyfriend is now mine. Warning: This movie contains bullying, suicide, bad words, kissing. If you're allergic to these, please don't watch this. <laughs> Sorry, I am allergic. To, I'm allergic to bullying. Oh come on! Another Gotcha Life video. <sighs> I guess you gotta do what you gotta do. What do I have to... Oh... Sex slave? Gotcha life? Oh boy. Oh, so some kids are having an orgy. That's wonderful. I'm only the... What the fuck? What? I I really don't know what to say. Uh, oh, okay, uh, Miss, you take the rest of the video. I'm I'm done here. I you can't just do, fine. Fuck you. All right, so where were we? All right, so this dude is like using a crayon on this person that's just hanging there. I'm very concerned. Oh, oh, oh look at him go! Look at him go! Oh? Oh, what the fuck? One, two, three, four, five thing. What? Oh, what? What does that guy do? Oh, what are they doing? Oh, uh, okay. Why do they do this? I don't know. The next morning. All right. So, so they're asleep. Dude with blue hair puts a PlayStation Move controller, uh, like, in in their ass. <laughs> what is that? What is that? <laughs> Next time you know what to wake up, you sound like my mother. What the fuck? To be continued. Please don't continue this. That is all I ask. I feel a strange sense of completion and closure. First time we said 100 likes, the second time I said 130, but I removed that section, and this is the end of the gotcha saga. It feels like a long-term sugar daddy relationship, except, like, it was closed once it got enough money that I needed. You know, fuck. I have no clue what any of that means, but you know what? I agree. I'm really glad to have been a part of this finale, and I hope we get to collab more in the future, Wolfside. Hey.
Pull up with a stick Now drive me a line, but you're making me real quick Slice out a vein, make it squirt like a dick